Hi guys, Philip here and in this video I'm going to show you how to create a sales funnel for affiliate marketing. Right? Uh, as you can see here, this is a basic outline and I want to talk to you about this so you understand how you can do this for free almost uh, or you can do it for a very low cost and you do not need any kind of secret app or any secret software or any kind of lead generating magnet machine thing. Right? You don't need anything. Uh, if you want, you can do it for free, uh, but I would recommend you pay for certain tools just to help you uh, move along faster. All right. Uh, so this here is how you're going to how how to create a sales funnel for affiliate marketing. But before I start, guys, uh, please subscribe and like my channel. And if you're watching this before April thirtieth, two thousand twenty. You need to come and register right now for my webinar. Okay, uh, there'll be a link in the in the description below. Uh, on the thirtieth of April, there is some, there's, a, there's a product being launched which is epic, right? Which is absolutely fantastic, and the best part, it costs less than a pizza, right? Um, now this strategy that's being launched. Um, which I'll be unveiling for you during my webinar is a very beginner friendly way to drive traffic to a very cool um, secret little Swedish page um, where you can drive uh, paid traffic uh, from Facebook and very cheaply to generate tra traffic leads and sales for your business for any niche, right? And uh, this here is a beginner friendly way and anybody can implement this, okay? So make sure you come, click the link below, come to my webinar on the 30th of April and you're going to get some kick-ass training there uh, that you can buy for less than a slice of pizza. Okay, not a slice, a whole pizza. <laughs> All right, uh, but for now, we'll jump back in here and start uh, creating our sales funnel. All right, so let's create our sales funnel. So uh, first off, we need to create our uh, lead magnet page and we need to uh, link up our autoresponder and we need to create a thank you page and a download page. All right, um, and so I'll just jump straight in here and get started. And so first off, uh, well, you, you want to come into your uh, dashboard on WordPress or uh, whatever uh, website builder you have and go to add new page. And here you simply create a new page and you call it whatever you want. This here is your lead magnet. Okay. Um, or here's your, this is your opt-in page. Okay. You call this opt-in, call it whatever you want to call it. It doesn't matter. Okay. And depending on what uh, what plugins you have and so on, uh, you want to ideally you want to no index this page because obviously you don't want it to be found in search engines. Um, and then you simply click on publish. Okay. And here you want to uh, you can either you you can actually use the um, WordPress default builder if you want to use free. A, a, a completely free resource here to do that uh, but obviously I do recommend you use some kind of page builder right um, personally I use Five Architect uh, but there are many out there you have click funnels you have optimized press you have you know oh God, there, there are so many and there's a 99% chance you already have one right so just use it and then uh, basically all um, all page builders come with templates guys they come with done for you pre-made templates Right, and you can see here, uh, you know, Thrive, Thrive Architect have um, hundreds of templates here, and it's as simple as this, guys. You just come in here, choose a template, and they most likely there's a 99% chance that you already have these templates already on your page builder in some form. You just pick one that you like, pick one you think, yeah, I like that, that's cool, and then you simply choose a, a, a lead generating conversion based one, or you can build one from scratch. Okay, I just want to choose this one here just for the sake of argument, and I click on choose. All right. Now, uh, I know some of you guys may be thinking, oh, Philip, this is not fair. I don't have a page builder. The chances are you do, right? You, the, ch the most likelihood is you've bought one already. Okay. If you haven't got the page builder, I recommend Thrive Architect purely because it's very, very cheap. Okay. Uh, it's about places like ClickFunnels. Yeah, Click, ClickFunnels is great, but it's way too expensive for a beginner uh, and the monthly fee will simply cripple you. Okay. And now, um, if you want a, f a complete guide on how to create the perfect lead magnet, uh, then jump inside my 12-step action plan and go into the email marketing section. Okay, I've got a whole uh, module in there about how to create a perfect lead magnet, uh, because that in itself is a whole 20-minute video. Okay, so here, the purpose of a lead magnet is simply to for you to offer somebody something to help them um, do something. Like, for example, save time make more money, increase conversion rates, increase opt-in rates, increase something, okay? Something that's going to benefit your viewers, right? And it needs to be super short and simple, right? The headline needs to be super short to the point, what's the benefit of someone opting in? Why should someone say here, click here, yes, I want this, right? Uh, and uh, from here, you simply uh, um, connect up your autoresponder to um, your this page, okay? And again, if whatever page builder you're using, 
you will have uh, the option to integrate your autoresponder. Uh, you click on your lead generation um, um, uh, block and you simply click on add autoresponder and you add whatever it is you have. Okay, I use get response. That's my recommended um, autoresponder. Again, the chances are, guys, you already have one. So I'm not going to go through, oh, sign up here and click here because you guys already have autoresponders. I know you do, right? Um, I recommend going with uh, get response, Aweber or Drip. Right. Uh, please don't go for places like Mailchimp or MailerLite, um, even though they may they may seem tempting because they are, they have you know free trials and so on. Uh, because um, places like Mailchimp, MailerLite, at least from my experience, have very um, strict terms and conditions where um, you can't promote most products. Okay, certain things in the weight loss niche or the make money online niche or forex trading, whatever, they'll just ban your account. So I would recommend you go for a Aweber or Get Response or Drip, right? Or Active Campaign as well. Uh, so uh, you simply connect up your autoresponder, okay? And then you create your lead magnet here. You have the headline, right? If you don't have a lead magnet, uh, something to give away, um, then you can go and buy some PLR. I don't really recommend it, uh, but that is the easiest and faster way to do it, right? Um, but again, if you jump inside my 12-step action plan, the link will be below. Uh, I've got complete training there on how you can uh, proceed with this, okay? So here, you simply connect up your autoresponder, and then uh, you will pass them on to uh, the thank you page. And you do that by selecting your um, your uh, lead generation form. And uh, after they submit here, you can see here, redirect after uh, they submit. And here you put in your URL for your thank you page. And you come back here to your WordPress dashboard. And from here, you simply go to create a new page. And you create another page. This one you call thank you or call it whatever you want to call it. Okay, thank you. And again, uh, I want to no index this. Hit publish, and here is your URL for this, okay? And then you simply come back here, and you paste this in here. So when somebody opts into this lead magnet, they are then passed on to the thank you page, and they also enter your autoresponder. Now, I know I know what you're thinking right now. Philip, you go too fast, you're not showing us anything, and this is too quickly, and also I don't have Thrive Architect. That's why I'm not doing it. The reason I'm not showing you step for step for step is because the chances are there is a very high likelihood that you have a completely different page builder from me. Right, so I'm just showing you the foundation here. I'm showing you the outline of what you need to do, and you need to do the actual individual click for click for click. Right, and also I have a complete 12 step action plan um, that you can go and check out uh, to learn all this stuff. Okay, I'm just trying. To, I'm, 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 I'm basically trying to show you this so you understand what you're doing. So we've we've now got the lead magnet page. We now have the opt in pay opt in form integrated, and we now need to. Um, uh, create the thank you page okay so the thank you page is created right um i'll just quickly jump in here and go into the again the the page builder for this page and then from here you simply go and create i'll find that some template here and here they'll have a thank you page okay here mini confirmation page or thank you page And here, I will now uh, basically have, you know, you can have step one, step two, you can have five, or three is best, okay? So again, once they've been to this page and put in, yes, I want this, they are then passed onto this page where they say, go and check your inbox, all right? Find their inbox, and then click on the link inside, right? One, two, three, boom. Again, you, you can edit this to your heart's content, right? You edit this and change it to suit your brand, suit your name, change your background, and so on. But this is the basic form. So that's your thank you page. And also what people sometimes do is they'll put in a little bump offer here, a little promotion saying, oh, by the way, while you're here, would you like to buy this or do you want this, right? And that's an, another way to increase conversions. And then obviously now they uh, have to go and check their, uh, their inbox. And when they go and check their inbox, uh, they are then sent the welcome message and then they, they go to the download page. And again, here, come to your WordPress dashboard and you click on add new. And from here, again, you simply call it download, or call you know, again, call it whatever you want to call it, so you know what it is. And I will exclude this from my sitemap, and then go publish. And then here is your download URL, okay? And this one here goes inside your welcome email, okay? And again, go to launch Thrive Architect, and from here, you would, again, simply choose whatever template you want. Uh, I'll, I'll continue continue with this theme here. Go to mini squeeze download, and here, this is the download page where somebody will actually come here to download their lead magnet, 
right? And again here, you can have, you know, subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can have, oh, I'll buy my, here's my latest training. You can have anything you want here. But the essence here, here, you have the download link for your uh, lead magnet. Now, whatever your lead magnet is, you can upload it to your Google Drive. You can upload it to your Dropbox or your OneDrive, your whatever, okay? There's, there's, there's so many places you can store it uh, and then they s s simply download it. And then that's how it starts, okay? And so that's your basic funnel setup. So do you now see how all these products out there that sell you these sort of shiny objects of, oh, you have to have our lead generating uh, page building system where we create automatic lead magnets and automatic this. It's like, well, you don't actually need that. I've just created the three pages in less than 10 minutes, right? Now, obviously, guys, you have to go in and tweak each one. You have to go and tweak every one, design it. You have to create a lead magnet in the first place. Um, I'm sure you can see that. For me to show you that in a de detailed tutorial, it'll, it'll be at least an hour long tutorial, right? As opposed to 10 minutes. But And I know that you, all you guys will have very different different experience levels and different levels of ability to use page builders and so on. And so for me to sit here and actually go and click and change text and click and save and change color, change background, and click and that, 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 you know, for most of you guys, it'll be a waste of time because I know that most of you guys will have the technical ability to do this, okay? You just need help getting the structure of like, what do I link together here and there and there? This graph here shows you that. You have the lead magnet. They then click on the button, they go, they um, are then enter into your lead list where they get the first welcome message and then they're passed onto the thank you page, right? Their thank you page tells them you have to go and check your inbox and click the link in your email. And that's what links to the download page. And then the download page links to your free report or your free video course or your free whatever it is you've got. Right? Um, and then from there, uh, they are then you then send them emails as you go. All right. And so this, guys, is how you create a simple, profitable um, sales funnel for affiliate marketing. Right? Now, when it comes to traffic sources, guys, Traffic sources are tricky, okay? I would highly urge you, if you're a beginner, do not buy solo ads. It doesn't matter where you're buying it from, solo ads, ads are extremely risky and a very expensive way to grow your list, all right? And also the list you're growing is very, very uh, weak and it's uh, incredibly dangerous, okay? What I recommend you do is use YouTube, use blogging, use social media, use free methods until you start getting some sales and until you get some experience and until you understand the concept because the problem uh, or the thing you have to understand with this, this type of structure here is the fact that every lead magnet is different. Every traffic source is different, which means that every traffic source will react differently and convert differently depending on your lead magnet and vice versa. So whenever you create a sales page, a, a sales funnel like this, you need to let the data tell you if it's working or not, right? Um, because you can change one thing. For example, if I were to change the background image on the um, this here, if I, if I change the background image and change the color of the button here, that will have an impact on your conversion rate, right? So it doesn't matter what product you have, what your lead magnet is, you always let the data tell you what's happening. Is it converting well? Cool, it is. Is it, are people clicking on your link in your email? If they are, great. If they're not, change it, okay? And the same goes for everything. Do, do not make it personal. Don't fall in love with the traffic source. It's about the numbers. What do the numbers tell you? The numbers tell you your lead, your lead magnet is converting or is not, right? If it is, great, keep it and tweak it and split test. If it's not, change it and split test and make it better, okay? So when it comes to this, guys, you do not need some secret method or some secret strategy or some secret software, okay? You can build it one, two, three, boom, you've built your first sales, sales funnel, right? Obviously, you need to tweak things and add a legal disclosure and all that stuff. Uh, but I've got a 12-step action plan inside my um, uh, my membership area. Click the below. I've got one in there. Also, guys, like I said, on the 30th of April, there is a really awesome beginner-friendly strategy being launched. Okay. And come to my live webinar. I'm going to show you inside. I'm going to show you what you get. It's very important. So click the link below. Come and register. And I'll see you on the 30th. All right. But for now, guys, this is how you build a very simple sales funnel for affiliate marketing. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, if you want the free training, click the link below. Jump inside. And I'll see you soon. Cheers.